This is a pack made by... Uh, I have to read that name again. Yako Madobi. Yako Madobi, this is the pack. The last game I played in this collection was the Paparazzi game, which was pretty... It was pretty... No. D3 Publisher. Here we go. This game is called... Uh, what the fuck is this game called? I don't know. Uh, let, let me see. Chat member probably already translated it, but I'm going to tell you what it says here. It says here, the Otokachi no Kizu Hausa, and then in parentheses, warning loud. Uh, okay. Warning loud is not the subtitle of the game. This is part three of part two of PlayStation 2 budget titles. The sound is totally blown out. Amazing audio mixing. This is the 100th game in this series? No. The simple series, you mean? Because if it's in the simple series, that makes sense, because it could be a million genres. Well, a hundred, specifically. That's really bad. Why, why is there a holographic general? So yeah, when you get hit, the screen just shakes violently, and, um... Who the fuck is that? Like, I know I'm not shooting well, but goddamn. Yep, turret shoot game. This would have been acceptable as an NES game. Like, obviously the visuals are a whole different story, because they're, you know, 3D, but I'm just saying, like, from a gameplay perspective... Like, you are turret, you shoot, and Hollow General is in the background. Yo, Hollow General's worth a lot of money. Reverse Hollow General's worth even more. My, uh, my Gorilla card I got, by the way, I have one hollow, one reverse hollow of the Gorilla. I thought they were the same card, and then I looked a little closely. I was like, oh, oh, it's one and one. What's the name of the Gorilla? Rilla Boom. Yeah, Rilla Boom. Danky Kang. Danky Kong. That's him. Yep. That's the card. That's a Pokemon. I 
I want to see what the boss would be like, chat. I want to just see if there's any other things here. Oh, dear lord. Oh, dear god. Maybe with a mouse, I could play this game a little more effectively? Oof. That is unfortunate. Um... Yeah, that's the Simple 2000 series. 100th game. This is Motorbike King. This next one. Yep. Okay, Motorbike King. Game is started. This software is a work of fiction, and the cars and locations are entirely fictitious. Oh, thank God. Now, again, the Simple series was a budget series that you could buy with less money. So, I'm not, you know, I've been really harsh on these games, but there have been some decent moments here and there. Um, the real funny shit and the real crusty ones, I think, were in part one. Wow, menu. My name. My name is my name. My team is my team. What a pump. Damn, that is a hell of a... Dude won. I love the hair. From the top, it kind of looks like if you opened meat. This guy's name is Ijiro Funakoi. You're flat. Yeah, their, their faces are very long. What kind of hair product do you have to use to get hair like that? Cement? Oh, cool. <laughs> the music. Johnny Rock and Roll on the bicycle. Sorry, motorcycle. It's like American Graffiti Japan Edition. Problem is, my character is pretty big, which means that I can't really see over the pump. Quality is evident. Oh wow. Yeah, tight tunnels. Yeah. The camera is pretty bad, um, the controls aren't as bad, but when the level is so... Like, what is this? Oh man, I guess I should drift? How does one drift? Even le letting go of the gas isn't really enough. Uh, 
Yeah, they're not making this easy. It's a whole lot of geometry here. You can almost see everything. Zero AP. <laughs> I'm not sure how that happened a moment ago, but I'd like to repeat that. I thought I pressed a button that made me skid like that, but it, nothing was pressed. I don't... I don't really know. My... my team? My name! <laughs> Boo... Whoa. I mean, here's a bonus. The slide guitar is sounding real stanky and nice. But the way the camera is, like, okay, do you see how big my character and the bike are compared to the cars and the trucks? Have we... Has anyone really done, like, a sense of scale? How'd you go through that? Is this cyberpunk? There's no easy way to make these turns. Maybe, again, I'm pressing every button looking for something that could drift, but... <laughs> Disappointed, but still biking. I can watch the replay. Oh, there's some different camera angles. Okay, look at these lads, and then look how huge my guy is. Nine and a half feet tall, at least. Look at these cool devs. But yeah, this camera angle is at least better. I'll give credit where it's due. At least there's an option. The song genre is called Big the Cat Music. <laughs> Alright, next is Tokusatsu Henshin Hero. Yes, Tokusatsu. Henshin a go go, baby! Whatever that means. I, pl I played Beautiful Joe. It'll always be D3. Don't expect anything else. I think the whole segment is D3. It's the seal of qual. Oh. Hmm. Oh man, I wanted to play as the bird. Wait, Power Rangers?
beautiful Joe? Should I be old? I know the jokes are gonna come after that one. Like Vinny, you already are. Oh man, I pressed the wrong damn button. Power Rangers would be tokusatsu. It's a genre. Oh, okay. Mate. Dekai seifuku o takuramu aku no himitsukesha memedesu dan. Desumukin taite hikiru memedesu dan wa. So exciting. Tsugi tsugi to kaizou ningen wo umidashi. Yono naka o kyoufu to konran e otoshiire o toshite ita. Shujinko honjo o takeru wa. メメデス団の怪人、ロボデス側の手にかかり、不遇の死を遂げる。絶命間際の竹に忍び寄る白衣の老人。彼こそ、デスムキンの旧友であり、メメデス団の野望を阻止線がため、密かに準備。I understand. Thank you. I got all that. There are storms. Mhm. Mm There's storms. And the lightning is 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 striking regular ninjas and turning them into kaiju ninjas and you are part of the old rangers you gotta stop them oh, 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 oh my god they're why do i know this music i think they just did a sieg heil um so I, I didn't read that part in the story so, yeah, that was, uh, I missed that part. Uh... Wow, the animations. So there's two buttons. There's punch, with, which has a 1-2 combo, and then there's kick, which has a 1-2 combo. They serve the same purpose, as far as I can tell. <laughs> Imagine that! You go from transform- you go to transform into a Power Ranger and you're just old. Like, why is this even an option? Well, sadly, you just do more damage, and that's it. What were they called in the Power Rangers? Putties? These are Yiga Clan putties. Oh, wow. Such a... exciting series of battles. <laughs> and yeah, they meow when they die. Is that it? Is that it then? At least they're reading a script. There are like achievements. This is a massive wall of achievements. What other achievements are there? Kick four times, then punch twice? Kick four times, punch twice, then kick four more times, then punch two more times. 
Maybe there's different moves. Oh, Clearly, gosh. I can't read this, so... So I don't know what's going on there. There could be... You know, there, there could be more things. Maybe you unlock moves. But that was uh, really, like, just your, as standard, as basic as it comes. You know, you want a brawler to have more than, a, like, a couple moves. But uh, th those were two moves. That's why we're going to play Taxi Rider next. We're going to catch a cab. Vinny, your character's name was Atamamamamamamamamami. Told your mummer, I'd get you home. I think about that a lot. I think about the word mummer. At least once every couple days uh, now. This game is fictitious. Oh good, once again we have fictitious game. There are some chat members that were hoping I forgot about the mommer thing. Just go to Led Zeppelin, How the West Was Won album, it's a live album, listen to Dancing Days, and listen to the way Robert Plant says the word mama. He says mommer. That's it. There's nothing more to that. There's no meme. Are these haikus? Starting, starting to, no, not quite. Tooth Gold Fang. So you're going to be working as a taxi driver, and you have to make a certain amount of money. You'll be working then. It won't be easy to make one million yen. For now, you'll only make a little money. Then you will make big money. One million yen equals ten thousand dollars. Some interesting, uh, chibi people. Fictitious beetles. The music is quite good. I'm not really sure where I'm looking. Um, do I have to just find randos? Your taxi is loved by all people. No people have been in the taxi yet. It's wacky taxi time. Is it just me, or are these arrows all pointing in different directions? Hmm. It sounds like Final Fantasy music. And that kind of looks like Sephiroth. So Sephiroth got in, and then Sephiroth got out. 
Oh, I, I think Sephiroth has multiple locations. One is the northern crater. But that's a little bit further out. That's the... That's the one million yen fair. Invisible wall, never mind. To station, there's a lot of people. Mate, you think I know where that is? Oh, there's a little mini-map. Well, this is not as bad as the other ones. This is... If, like, you need budget crazy taxi, and you don't have a lot of money, and you're in 2005, then, uh... I would say that, of, like, if I had to rank the budget titles, this is somewhere near the top. It's not amazing, but it's it's competent. It gets the job done. Do you need a taxi? Yeah, you only need a time machine, and then you'll get the most out of this. Someone said I'd return this within 24 hours if I rented it. Yeah, for rentals, you want to go for, like, the, the good stuff. For, if you want to just, like, get your nephew or niece a game and you only have, I don't know, 12,000 yen. Dragon Peak is forbidden for now. Oh, Dragon Peak, eh? How much is that? That's, uh, what, $120? Yeah, so if you have, like, say, uh, 1,200 yen, I don't know how much these games cost. It's called, it's 2,000 yen, and that's why it was called the Simple 2000 series. I see. So $20 games. Even then, you know, if you can find this in the bargain bin for like 5 to 10 bucks, that's a good gift for your, um, for your family. It does kind of sound a little bit like Sephiroth music. Like, seriously, that is One-Winged Angel-esque. It gets kind of close to that, and I'm picking up Sephiroth over and over again, so... Vacation, Sephiroth. It's time to go to Costa del Sol. This, this part. You don't hear it? It's it very... Uh, it's a stretch, I know. HIT THE TARGET! What does that mean, hit the target? Isn't my job as a taxi driver not to hit targets, Otacon? Quota. Hit the target. It's, it's gonna be it. Oh, no. It's not, it's not gonna be a dog, is it? No, please. Anything but that. It's like, it gets kind of dark every now and then.
Jeff Goldblum. No. I thought I was supposed to hit the target. <laughs> Vinny, you did? Oh, the target was the quota. Chat, I thought I had to knock over, like, a target. Vinny, is it pronounced Jeff or Geff? Oh, uh, definitely Geff. The, yeah, it's a hard J. It's, it's, uh, Geff Joldblum, one of my favorite actors, from Jurassic Park. So, I stand by what I said. I think that's at least got some, there's some energy and, and life put into that game. I know that sounds weird, why would I say it like that? But, but really, it could have been way worse. There's a game just missing. Alright, never mind then. The Taobu Prisoner, I, it's just gone. It's not even in the folder, so never mind. So, Heartbeat Boxing. So this one, what's interesting about this title is that you would put a, um, a pulse detector so it would get your heartbeat and if you got to a certain point, it would jolt you. Like it would send many voltage through your heart. Yeah, and, and the jolt would get you, like, dead. So if you got hit, it would simulate what it was like to get hit in the... Heartbeat boxing. I didn't expect this. That was a jape, by the way, obviously, but what... default mode. Every time I do budget titles, there's always, always a booba game. Always! Oh my god. Oh my god. Should I just change the title to Budget Titties? Seriously, chat, I'm sorry you have to be subjected to this filth. That, honestly, I don't think that's how they work. Oh my god. Down. One, two, three, four, five, there are six, enough of these games that you could make an entire segment just on these types of games. The budget, other stuff. 
I've already streamed them. I'm good. Um, because Yabak Makapi just keeps throwing them in there. I don't think I said that name correctly. Meanwhile, I'm like fascinated by the crowd. I have a question. Is this the same person from other games of this publisher? W wasn't Rian in, in another? Rian, whatever. The name, well, the name was, maybe. You don't want a box with glasses on. That's how you lose your fucking eyes. The worst part is that the boxing is actually not terrible. Like, I've played a lot of these budget title games that have terrible controls, and this is a perfectly competent budget boxing game. <laughs> That's the worst part! Is if you want cheap boxing, you also have to get helium. It comes with like a, a coupon for free jello. Sometimes your arm goes through their face. That's all right. Down. TKO. Survival mode? Oh, I guess you just keep punching, and then they keep punching you, and then eventually you lose. Yeah, it's the same thing. You saw the whole game. I mean, well... You get- you get the idea, chat. You get the idea. You don't need any more than that. This one's called... The Ona Okapichi... Tori Mano Chao <laughs> O Haru Chan Go 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 Let me say that a little quicker The Ona Okapichi Tori Mano Chao O Haru Chan Go 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 There's nothing in the folder again I wonder if it was removed It might have been removed It maybe didn't work Well damn I might have just saved the stream. Ona means woman, so that might have been Mega Booba game or something. That's your only piece of evidence, chat member.
someone came back as part of the temporal cold war and stopped you. Well, I caught up on the season opener and then Carbon Creek. So I missed them while uh, when you guys were watching them, but I caught up. They were good. Yeah, pretty good. I like Carbon Creek. Okay, so oh, this is different. So we're going from we're going from Jello to Beefcake. Yo, it's the same type of menu. Look at these. Look at these lads. Germany has a boxer called Lionheart. Of course. <laughs> well, she's there too, if, if needed. They just, like, control C and control V the physics. Whoa. 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 Oh, this is a different type of game entirely. Well, it's fucking, like, wrestling, I guess. Or MMA, or something. Man. Oh, every bone in their body is just breaking. All of their bones are breaking. Not one, all. <laughs> Can you stand up? Please? Um, come back, please? This is, uh... Pretty weird. It just I think it works, but I can't tell. Like the the gameplay. Very different difficulty curve. Ooh. Ooh. Oh, hey, Ross. Good time for you to join. You missed the... the jello. Someone said before that I did one move the entire time. I was... I assure you, I was just mashing buttons. Music is good. There we go. <laughs> look at look at the, the mantis pose that he's doing right now. trying to grab so I can break bones, but I can't do it. Oof. Alright. Okay. Alright. Alright.
So again, you got the idea. All-star fighting. This is the... Why is this game still open? Chat, I don't remember having this game still open. Nor do I remember this scene from the game. Is this a bit? I I'm pretty sure I closed the game, chat, and I we've not seen any of this. It's not scripted. Chat, this is fucking not a bit. If it was a bit, it'd be a better one. No, it wouldn't. It's you. All right, fair. All right, so this one is All Star Fighters. Vinny, please play this last. Oh, uh, hang on a second. There's a, a piece of information in regards to this game that I need to read. the information. Okay. Here we go. All-Star all Fighters. I got the information. It's all good. Information received. So, here's the... It's Riho. Futaba. This, this is the character we've seen... Is there a shader error? Why is she covered in oil? Did you see- did you see that? Did you see that, chat? Why, why does that happen? Why does that happen? Okay. Earth Defense Force. Holy shit, what is this game? Kyo Asuka Mayuki Why does it do that? Death Doll Kakashi <laughs> Okay And yep, that's uh, Yep, that's how you teach Okay. Most of these are character. Most of these characters are stars, but most of them are hentai characters. I don't know if that chat is lying or not. I believe it. It's party time, battle fest for all the craziest characters you've ever seen. Uh, sit right back, shake your hands and feet, get ready for exciting fist swinging melee. Who's the strongest and who's the weirdest? The person who made the pack said that that's not true. These are characters from all the D3 games. While wow, they have their own cinematic universe. This is their Smash Brothers. 
Yako Madobi is the person who made the pack, and they said that that's not true. I remember back in Texas, you got to beat me or you can't protect your farm. That's... Oh. Oh, you know about them Texas farms? Everyone's got one. Every single person in Texas. I mean, you can see the jank already. From standing animation to walk. Yeah, it's just, yeah. I mean, I appreciate the effort. It looks better than the rest of the games, kind of. Shin kick for the, for the fucking victory. I wonder if there are any, like, cool special moves that I'd be able to do. I just found the best special move. Aw, oh, man, my cheese was countered. Imagine being slapped to death by a pumpkin child. God, I did it. I made a comeback. I finally found a fighting game I'm good at. I don't care if you're a hero. You can't come into my fields. Sorry, son. This land is seized by our planet's enemy. Gigantic ants. Look, there are miniatures of them all over. <laughs> well, this just isn't fair. He, he's got guns. Can't stop the slap power, though. S knee slap. Is this just a generic EDF, man? Like, does anyone copyright EDF? Or is this a thing that multiple people can, um, can use? It's generic. D3 actually owns EDF? Mental. I mean, for me, their reputation is almost as bad as LJN because of the stuff I've played from them on Sundays. But people are saying EDF is good. Maybe they've made some good stuff. EDF is, uh, has been memed into popularity. Oh. I've never played EDF. I'm aware of it. I played a mod for EDF. I thought EDF was um, Dragon Ball Z. I remember Gokun was um, in there. There was a mod for Half-Life and, and like Goku was in, in EDF. Is that a different thing? That's ESF Earth Special Forces. Oh, okay. I 
I can only view one character. It's a very natural movement. Ah, for fuck's sake. EDF is like if Body Harvest was good. Okay. <laughs> well, I wish Body Harvest was good. It, you know what? It is, though. It actually is good. It's just emulating it is not a good experience. And there were some other problems that I was willing to overlook when I was younger. But it's still not a bad game. I actually did enjoy it. I just didn't want to stream any more of it with the s emulation issues. But yeah, chat, you get the idea. Um... Whoa, animation's moving way too fast. We, it's party time. I wish I could have read that. God damn it. Where's the rewind? Wow, a bad girl. Woo, I've never seen it so close. Back off, princess. I'm no freak show. There's something wrong with her shaders. Effective fighting style. Kinda just got styled on. It's pretty jank, but it's not terrible. Like, again, this is, uh... <clears throat> ah, excuse me. Compared to some of the other ones, it's at least playable. I don't know if there's a whole lot of special moves, but... Oh my god. <laughs> oh my god. chat. Wow, a talking kitten. Kitty kitty. And she was a walking giant, right? Yeah, I guess I'm a pretty normal in this circle. Oh, because Riho was the, the giant in Budget Titles Part 1, she was the giant in that one game. Why is there a Neko? I'll have you know I am trying to do many moves. Well, I found that mashing buttons is also pretty effective. Round 
that, look at that effective move. The one where you jump, and then you just, like, booty land. That's a good, effective fighting move. Wow, that, that was physics. Yep. Yeah, no, physics don't apply anymore, it doesn't matter. I mean, we're in card land anyway, so... Okay, we'll see one more character in action, then I'm done. Is she your main? Riho main confirmed. I admire you, Aya. You only do jobs that fit your image, but me? Sai. Hey, you're good with a bi with bikini, with a sword, and you even became a giant. What else do you want? <laughs> Very good at this game. <laughs> I think she needs a nerf. All right, I'm done. Oh my god. All right, well, that's uh, that's it. That's all I've got for this PS2 budget titles. Um, like, I'm talking the whole collection is done. So that's three full parts of PS2 budget titles. I wouldn't be surprised if there are more. But for now, that's the end of that. I mean, we have more interesting segments in the future. We've got, like, homebrew and Famicom stuff. But, uh, yeah, that was a good segment. Thank you, Yakima Bobi. Um, some, a couple empty games. There probably reasons that those games were not in those folders, to be honest. Probably some very good reasons. But whomst knows. Hello, I'm Luigi, 